Prof's music, along with a deep knowledge of the tradition, mixed with a personal taste for composition, became a landmark for many jazz lovers across Italy and Europe. In over 15 years of music career, Massimiliano Rolf toured extensively Europe and USA, alongside with some of the world's finest jazz musicians, and released four albums as leader and more than 20 as sideman and co-leader. Based in Genoa, in the sunny Italian Riviera, is today leading and performing his own music with several bands across Italy and Europe. Scream the rage, scream the anger, scream the joy, scream the happiness, scream the satisfaction, scream the fear and scream the unconditional love. Each song in my new album wants to be a suggestion and an invitation at screaming for a better world. The album Scream is released in July 2014 by Italian independent label Blue Art, run by music lover and manager Rosario Moreno. We'll have a, a physical distribution at the concerts and a worldwide distribution to the main digital stores on the web. The music of Scream is born last year. This time I've tried to put uh, in the same collection of music some more simple tunes and some more complex forms. And for the first time, compared to my previous work, we are not, uh, the music is not connected to the jazz idiom, but it has a more European feel to it. While the rhythms are still uh, a blend of rock, black music and Latin grooves. The music I present in Scream has been thought to let the, the other musicians as free as possible to express their self and their ideas through their solos and through the, their improvisations. Uh, well, this has been always a trademark of my productions. In my previous work, I always uh, performed the music before recording it. This time I tried to, to do the opposite. So we actually built up the repertoire during some rehearsals and then we went straight to the studio. Uh, I think this way there would be uh, the chance to, to go on stage with more freshness and to develop the music after the recording, which is a process that I find interesting right now. We found actually a couple of days uh, off uh, in late March and we went to record the music at the Orange Home Studio on hills close to Genoa.
sound of this group is different from other projects I've done previously. Most groups have featured horn players and I've rarely worked with keyboards in the band. But I wanted a different sound for this group and started thinking about a quartet with piano and percussions. That certainly has opened up some different musical directions. A big challenge for me is always to try to express sophisticated harmonies with simple and accessible result. The rhythm is clearly the main ingredient in this album, and dynamics are another evident element of this music. Many tunes display a wide range of dynamics, helping to draw different music sceneries and surprises through the complex forms. I've toured many times with drummer Nicola Angelucci. Despite of his young age, he already gained a wide experience and is now one of the most demanded drummers in the country. Fabio Giacchino, the pianist, is based in Torino, which is now the new capital city of jazz in Italy. He is a rising star in the jazz national scene. And then we have Juan Carlos Caldero, a Cuban percussionist. I think he's been able to add to my music a very specific and international touch. Well, with my double bass, I'm still, of course, still learning. It's a hanging experience, so you never stop learning. And um, the last few years, uh, I had the chance to, to perform a lot of mainstream jazz with some great jazz players. And um, that helped me a lot to develop this, uh, this language. And, uh, but I always tried to keep on going with my own personality, which uh, I think is the most distinctive aspect of a jazz musician. Also in this, uh, in this new album, Scream, the double bass is uh, it's a big support to the music, and, uh, but uh, compared to my previous works, uh, it has also some leading melodies, and sometimes it becomes the main character in the scene. I've made some records in the past with some great names, and that makes, of course, easy to sell. But um, I've learned that uh, if you want to develop your own sound uh, with your own musician, uh, well, you shouldn't use someone else's name to go on and just work on your own music uh, on long term. This is the business idea behind Scream and uh, also behind my other works. Uh, thinking long term, people like to listen to music and I like to produce it and to write and to play it, so I go for it. Thank you. 